While you celebrated that those annoying taxicab videos might be going away, you probably missed car sensors as clothes, kinetic energy art, and the scientific breakthrough of pigs as organ donors. Welcome to In Case You Missed It, where my heart has been unavailable ever since Babe the Pig stole it back in 1995. Hello, sir. Yeah, I'll be out. Oh, oh. Gene researchers, mostly from Harvard, published a paper in Science this week that suggests we could edit the genes in the average pig so that their organs could be used for transplants in humans. Apparently, geneticists removed some DNA sequences from pig cells that are believed to be harmful to humans. So these guys, just hanging out in their field, might be in you one day. And that bacon you've been munching might have been the father of the great to the 15th pig that actually saves your life. <coughs> Feel terrible. You might think your fashion game is on point, but you've got nothing on this collection. A Dutch designer made 3D printed dresses for an Audi themed collection, putting the same sensors found in cars in her clothes. One of the pieces reacts when people approach it, and another is simply an angular display for a projector. Normally you would have a fashion designer or an engineer or an architect, but now our generation is being really pushed to be at all, to be uh, working really interdisciplinary. And then there's the lighted car dress or the creepy spider one. Ugh. Which reminds us of the fashion show that used people as backpacks in real life. Basically, we've gone full Zoolander. There it is. Did you ever wish your living room furniture was louder than an industrial printing press and moved like the box people at the Beijing Olympics? The MIT Media Lab invented this unique machine slash art installation. It senses the kinetic energy of a viewer waving their hand over the machine and converts that information into wave-like movements with dynamic pins. Because art. And finally, Universal is celebrating the anniversary of Back to the Future with an official hoverboard replica that you can buy. We've seen the DIY knockoffs, but the most annoying bra on the planet is pitching the board in this commercial in case that's something you want to support. All the time, bruh. Houston, we have air. Join the air pollution with the hoverboard. Air's no longer for just breathing, bruh. See you later, bras. We're sorry. <laughs>